The future of Doherty County Interim School Superintendent Dr. David Mosley has been up in the air after a law went into effect that forced the school board to make a tough decision. Today, board members found out Dr. Mosley's fate. Fox 31's Colby Gallagher has details. It was called a long shot in July when the Doherty County School Board requested a special waiver from the state allowing interim superintendent Dr. David Mosley to remain in place on a part-time status. The motion was an attempt to work around a piece of legislation that passed restricting retired administrators from coming back to work full-time. As of October 1, if we did not get a waiver for it to have a 49 percent superintendent, then we would lose Dr. Mosley and he would not be able to finish the job. But on Thursday, the State Board of Education unanimously voted to pass the proposal, proving that long shot wasn't so far at all. Board members say numerous letters sent from local representatives gave them the support they needed. And if the motion wasn't accepted and the school system wanted to keep Dr. Mosley, they would have had to pay to bring him out of retirement. This is what I wanted. It's best for me. And it will save the system about 85 or 90,000 bucks. So it's a winner for everybody. Now that the school board has their answers, they say moving forward they're going to focus on two things. First, making sure Dr. Mosley's goals are achieved during his time here. And second, finding that permanent replacement who will be able to follow in his footsteps. And in order to do that, Dr. Mosley says the finances, staff, and leadership must be solid throughout the entire system. All of those are the things that I'm working on along with my team to try to, to improve that so that that situation will exist for the new person. The more problems we solve, the better candidates we will attract. The board hopes to begin their new superintendent search this winter and have the replacement chosen before the end of the school year. Colby Gallagher, Fox 31 News.